Hey you guys, so this would be what, beta day five? Yeah, right. Yeah, five. Five, so. Um, I thought I would show you guys um, an app that I use on a regular basis called Tap Tap C, and it's an app that lets me see um, whatever it's taking a picture of. So if I'm taking a picture, I should have bought um, cans of food or something to show you, but instead I have clothing because I use it a lot to match the kids' clothing. It'll tell me the color. It sometimes will be really specific and tell me exactly what's the graphic on the shirts because the boys are really into graphic tees character shirts and then um it'll also tell me um if i'm if i'm looking maybe for like specifically a can of something that may look like something else like between a can of corn and a can of beans and things like that it also will tell me pretty much anything um, i've used it to locate my detergents and anything that is a printed label or that i need a specific detail on i will use it to um to help me so i thought i would show you it's pretty cool it's pretty accurate sometimes it can be a little <laughs> like um, you know, it, it's it's a little sometimes a little iffy. Yeah, there you go, iffy. That's the word. Because depending on the update that they make, but yesterday or even today it worked well. So let's see how it works today. I have a shirt. This is one of Noah's shirts, and I'm going to. I think I already know what shirt this is already, but lift it up. Let's see the front of it. Okay. I can't see what it I've is. I've covered my face, so I'm pretty sure they got it. All right. <laughs> it's the best way to do it. So I'm pretty sure I know what shirt that is, but um, it could be wrong. So what you do, and there's a camera button, there's a library button, you can share and all that stuff. So what I'm going to do is hold the camera over the, my phone over the, the thing, double tap it. It'll take the picture, it'll say picture one in progress, and it takes a bit depending on the lighting too, because that's, that's another thing, you have to have really good lighting for it to work properly or as well as it can work but it is pretty accurate see this is a Paw Patrol print shirt which I knew it was because I recognize the feel of the graphic on the shirt and it's a little bit worn because while well, Noah is constantly getting w w washed because <laughs> he wears it a lot this is his Paw Patrol shirt which I have to kind of know what it is because it's one of his favorite favorite t-shirts so so that's Noah's t-shirt and this is one of his pair of pants I Cannot remember the color of this one because he has the pants in different colors that feel exactly like this one. So this is a good one. So I'm going to lay it on here. Oh, my phone locked. Let me unlock it. And I'll do it again. I will take, take a picture. It'll say double tap to take a picture of what's in front of you. And then you take the picture and it says in progress. And you give it a bit and it'll come up with whatever this is. Sorry, just give it a second. <laughs> again, it... It can depend on the, the lighting. Well, it kind of just got everything. It says these are black. In either case, his shorts that do feel like that are usually black or khaki. So these are black. So I know that, okay, he can wear these black shorts. And he can wear this Paw Patrol shirt. And he not matches. And I don't have to worry about my kid walking around looking like a disaster. <laughs> looking like Rainbow Bright. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, I've used it myself to match my undershirts with my as you you guys well today no i'm just in sweats but um if i'm wearing a dress or something like that you guys notice that i layer it and it's usually with black undershirt or if i'm wearing I, I match it up and then i will match the scarf and things like that so i will usually use that app to do it and this is something i'll do one more i have a bunch of i did laundry so <laughs> i have a bunch of this is uh one of suhela shirts and i think yeah yeah this is one of suhela shirt and I am going to take the picture. It's pretty cool. Um, there was the picture. I really should have bought um, labels so you guys could see it. But I guess you guys can get the picture just from, from the clothing. It's really cool. It is very helpful. The app itself is free. Um, you used to have to be buy every three months or every so often a subscription. It's pink, gray, and black. And so I figured. I know what this was. This is the one with her little watermelon in so, um, that's pretty much, I will find, I, that's how I match things, that's how I know what's what. And then, you used to have to be able to buy, you used to have to buy these uh, subscriptions where you would get either 100 pictures or a certain amount of pictures or unlimited pictures for like 3 months. But, the last time I bought unlimited pictures for 3 months was like, 
<laughs> I have no idea how long ago and I've been using it and using it and I've been waiting for it to tell me to renew and it hasn't happened so yay for that maybe they've updated that and I haven't been aware that maybe once you purchase a uh, an unlimited subscription to the pictures maybe it's just a one-time deal now that would be great though don't watch this tap tap see guys <laughs> I tell they're watching Don't watch my this tiny, video, Tap Tap C. My people. YouTube channel reviewing Tap Tap C. Don't watch it. <laughs> if if that's the case though, that's amazing and, I, and it makes And if happy. you are watching it and you would like us to be a sponsor, please email us at <laughs> at Mom through my eyes at gmail dot com <laughs> or Islam by touch at gmail dot com. So yeah, either way. <laughs> um but it is a great app. It is sometimes the updates can get a little screwy, but this one is really good and I love it. Um I have even used this app. Maybe I can show that one day on a different one. But I've even used this app to um, tell me what exactly of the directions on worksheets that I have printed or that, um, that I've pulled out of books for Della for school. So as long as it's um, like print, not not things like handwritten, because that, that has a little, it'll just tell you handwritten because it, you know, can't really read it. Yeah. But as long as it's on, you know, a printed label or printed sheet or the clothing or things like that, as you notice, they told me a Paw Patrol shirt. So it's, it's database is pretty, uh, expansive it's really cool it's really helpful and i just thought that that would be really uh i show you guys you know that's a little bit of how we do things as a blind uh couple when it comes to finding out information on labels and matching clothes and things like that and we'll do different things like this uh, throughout the month like i may take a video where i show you my video magnifier yeah and, and things like that um, yeah. i kind of want to show you guys how i have my uh, washing machine and things like that labeled it's pretty cool just to get let you guys know you know a little bit more of of how we are actually working things and how we modify things just to make everyday life happen. Anyways, in any case, if you have any comments, just leave them down below or questions, you, or you can comment or send your questions on Twitter or uh, Facebook. I gotta do something about my Facebook page because <laughs> it's just not. Um, anyway, that, <laughs> that, um, I gotta market it better. Anyway, um, you can do the on my Facebook page or on my Twitter. And check out our organization's and check website. Check out our organization's website, islambytouch.com. Islam Islam and the Facebook page for Islam by Touch is Facebook. Yes. Um, page for that. I'll leave it down in the description. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.